Southgate admits he expects increased scrutiny over his decisions. Gareth Southgate insists he can live with the heightened scrutiny on his decisions and accepts that increased criticism comes with the territory of being England manager. His side are on course to comfortably qualify for the 2022 World Cup and need only four points from next month's fixtures in Andorra and against Hungary at Wembley to secure a place in Qatar. This progress follows on from the Euro 2020 final. Southgate, though, is not naive and understands that the concession of a last-minute goal in the 1-1 draw in Poland on Wednesday, having chosen not to make any substitutions, leaves him open to having his decisions picked apart. It is not something that will fluster the 51-year-old. I 100% expect it all the time, said Southgate. It seems to be the way, so I wouldn't expect that to be any different after Poland. That's not important, what I think about it. People are more than entitled to look at performances or look at decisions and pass comment. That's absolutely fair in assessing games, that's the life of managers in high profile jobs, and you have to accept that as a manager at the very least. We were in total control of the game against Poland. We had one moment when the goalkeeper was charged down, then the goal at the end. There have been moments over the last fortnight when Southgate has looked haunted and it is clear the pain he felt after the penalty shootout defeat by Italy at Wembley on July 11 continues to linger, it will be some time before it is gone completely. To balance that, he feels the squad's recovery has been swift and pointed to the way they handled demanding assignments in Budapest and Warsaw with maturity. It is, he says, an example of their progress as a team. You learn a lot about the team when they play away from home, said Southgate. The resilience that they have, the control that they have, and making sure that they're able to cope with the atmosphere as well as the game. These are